guys, how are you? It's your girl Shadi Antonia and I have a new video. Let's go. You already know what time it is. So basically this video is going to be, as you see from the title, my top fives of makeup applications. And this is a collaboration with my girl Primetime Beauty. She's doing the don'ts, I'm doing the do's. So the link to her video will be down below and right here or somewhere around here, it'll be here. So you guys gotta make sure you watch her video too as well because like I said, she's doing the don'ts, I'm doing the do. These are like the, the must, you know? So okay, so I'm gonna start with one or five. I don't know, it don't matter if I wanna go from five or one. Makeup do number one. I feel like you must, you must highlight your face, ladies. You must, it's a must, it's a must. Because when you put on foundation, if you really take away like everything from your face, you take away any contours you may have, have to contour per se but I do feel like when you highlight you bring the life back into your face because naturally we all have light that hits our face right here right here right here right here right here right here so when you put on just foundation it's just flat so don't be out here just with foundation and some blush and think you're killing it because baby you're not killing it you ain't killing it no you ain't killing it for two ladies your eyebrows do your eyebrows do your eyebrows learn how to do your eyebrows and love your eyebrows okay when your eyebrows feeling the mean shape and the muck all of that it's the art and when it comes down to perfecting the art it takes practice okay eyebrows are supposed to be sisters not twin sisters okay so don't be trying to get your eyebrows trying to look exactly the same because it's not it's not gonna happen and if it does baby you still you deserve a medal but honestly they're supposed to be sisters not twin sisters you know, sometimes they may look like long distant cousins. I know I've kind of felt like that today about my eyebrows. But it's the art. But the thing is, learn how to fleek the eyebrow. Because your eyebrows, I feel like they're everything. Number three, when you're doing your foundation, ladies, blend it to your neck. Blend it to your neck. You got to blend it to your neck. Everything got to be smooth and even. You feel me? Listen to her. She knows what she's talking about. What I'm saying is, you don't have to put a whole thing of foundation on your neck. No, that's stupid. You're gonna get it everywhere. You don't want it to be a harsh line. Your foundation starts right here and then, it, you know, it's just different right here. No, you don't You don't want it to be like that at all because that's ugly. Unless you're a lucky person because unfortunately, I'm like 18,000 shades of brown all over my body. So unfortunately, I have to like, you know, make sure I'm evened out so I don't look too weird. But unless you're like exactly the same shade as your foundation all over, then okay, you get the pass. Dad, lucky you. Also, if you're putting, blending your foundation into your neck, make sure you set your neck foundation too because, for example, I have fat rolls, as you can see, into my, on my neck. So, when I blend my foundation into my neck, I sweat on my neck. I don't know if I'm the only one that sweats on my neck. Maybe I am. But... It creases, you know what I'm saying? So set that, you know, with the powder. Set it so it doesn't creak, so everything can look cohesive and put together. Number three, right? Wow, this is going back so fast. Oh yeah, number four, put on some blush. You know, nothing wrong with putting on blush. I had someone tell me, oh, I don't like blush. But see, I feel like when people think of blush, they think of like the rosy red blush, but no, honey, it's 2016, baby. There's blushes in, a, in, a, in an array of colors. An array. Put on some blush, bring some color to your face. Look alive. Look alive. Put on some blush. I guess my fifth and final do would probably be, you know, don't think too much into doing your makeup, okay? Your face is your canvas and you are the artiste. Make it your own. There, there are no set rules to make up. Make it your own. Just make it look good. But do it the way that you want. And work with what you got. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you check out Primetime Beauty. Make sure you, what am I saying? Make sure you check out Primetime Beauty's channel and her top five don'ts. We did a collab, so, you know, you gotta watch us next. Oh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe to me. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you follow me on social media. All the links are down below and of course, right here. I call it my personal don'ts because I feel like 
who am I to tell you what to do and what not to do? You know, like it's your face. If you feel like what you're doing is right, then that's cool too. But you probably should not be doing the five things I'm about to list. My first don't is don't wear concealer all around your brows unless